Hey uh, YouTube, so I've had a lot of people ask what is the Watcher? You know, people say Watcher Research, Watcher Construction, Watcher Monster Hunt. And I just wanted to show real quick for those uh, newer players. Uh, the Hell Event that pops up every hour. <clears throat> the source can be research, training, you know, troop training, construction, monster hunt, um, or construction. Rarely, uh, but fortunately, it will pop up from time to time, one with this Watcher badge in here. And you can see Army, Max, HP, and Attack, the best two stats you can possibly get, and Training Speed. And it's the only way to get this uh, hero. So basically, using whatever the source is, and it's only going to be one item uh, when it's for the Watcher badge, you have to meet this many points, you know, for 980,000 for the Research Watcher. And the research is the only one that is really, uh, you know, feasible to obtain. The monster hunt can be done as well, but the construction is impossible, except for that one time when you're uh, finishing your castle level 25, or if you want to spend just a ton of uh, effort getting uh, buildings finished. So let's see, if I were to take a level 24 mine, so 25, it's 41,000. And you have to have 680,000 for the construction. So I would have to uh, gem 10, that's 15, you know, that's 17 of them. And 17 times, uh, it's actually about 11 days. Yeah, about 11 days with the construction year on. So that's 100 and 190 days worth of speed ups to get the construction watcher badges so you're gonna want to try and get the watcher badges every time research pops up 980,000 points is equivalent to 980,000 might well the best way to do it is when you're finishing up your uh, researches to get to your t4 when each of these go to level 10 they give you above 980,000 points so you finish each one, you know, you gem it or use your speed ups when that watcher badge is available. <clears throat> there are other ones that knock it out in one shot also. Both of, or neither of those going to 10 did, but these going to nine and to 10 finishes it off. So you can see 2.8 million might. So I will more than meet my, uh, my requirement for that watcher badge. Um, never use your speed ups or gems before you get your 30 assists uh, because the assists are based on the time remaining. So this was the same requirements as the Barracks Expansion 10. As you can see, original 410 with my research and everything, I'm at 100 days. After 29 assists, I'm at 74 days. But I don't have a 30th person on to press it. And we are running out of time. We have 22 minutes to complete this. 29 out of 30. So, I'm going to go ahead and use the speed ups we have. I was able to obtain all these from the uh, the Vizier, or the Serpent Vizier, which is really nice because I had no speed ups at all. I had just used them all, and then this uh, Vizier popped up. So, I got some, uh, some nice speed ups. I was at 74 days, and I am down to 10 and a half days, 10 and three quarter days, which really is not bad in the grand scheme of things. Oh, I got that 30th assist somewhere in there. So, anyways, at that point, that's what you use gems for, because after you uh, after you get your battle hall altar and prison to 25, you can use gems on you know stuff that's actually productive. So right here, we should see Hell Event Reward Stage 3. I got three more Watcher Badges. You also get a nice three-day speed up in there and some other miscellaneous items, as well as some gems. It's really nice when the 24-hour challenge is also research. Let's see how close we are to that one. 840,000. Get a Terra Thorn Seed, another three-day speed up. So if another Watcher Research pops up in the next 2 hours and 20 minutes, 
I will be able to obtain that one. But I'm not going to go and jam or speed up just for 840,000, just for this, because it's been way more than uh, what I would get from it. The nice part is the Hell Event, if you do the best out of all the kingdoms, you know, you get a nice extra reward in here. If you get the Watcher Badge, there, there's usually, even if you hit the 980,000 mark <clears throat> exactly and you don't go above it, you're usually in this rank 51 to 100, because it seems like every time there's 100 or less people who get it. Um, well, yeah, about the 980, uh, about the million mark uh, puts you in this top 100. If you are doing the big ones like I just did 2.8 million, I might get really lucky and even hit that top three or so. But I have yet to hit the top one and I've completed some pretty big uh, researches and I've not gotten rank one in a single shot. So maybe I'll we'll get lucky with this one, maybe not. Either way, I hope you enjoyed, I hope that helps. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to put it in the comments below. Until next time, long live K9.